this topic you could get a couple of questions here in terms of calculations let's quickly understand about frequency distributions what I have taken is a stock called ACC cements and daily returns from January 2011 to January 2013 the max return was 6.5 the min return was 5.3 and effectively we have taken a range of occurrences so we have taken a range of occurrences less than 6 per minus 6 percent minus 6 to minus 4 4 to 2 minus 4 to minus 2 minus 2 to 0 and so forth and you see the occurrences these occurrences can be plotted on a histogram once you plot this on a histogram it gives you a curve which is similar to this now this is real life data but you find that the curve is very similar to something known as a normal distribution of returns of a particular stock over two years what is normal distribution it is a symmetric distribution with the following characteristics the mean and mode are equal a normal distribution is completely defined by mean and variance roughly 68 percent of the observations lie between this so that's 68 percent roughly 95 lie between minus two standard deviations and plus two standard deviations from the mean so that's 95 percent and roughly 99 percent lie from minus three to plus three standard deviations fine so that's what we are looking at in terms of a normal distribution as we go along